Libra, these are going to be your guidance cards for the week of June 15th through June 21st of 2021. So energy of the week, you have number 21, strategy. Um, so I'm feeling like the number 21 is going to be important for some reason. Um, I do see journal log on here, so it's possible you're journaling, but I'm feeling like you're creating some sort of plan for something. I'm getting like someone's brainstorming. All right, so we're going to clarify and we're going to use Queen of the Moon Oracle to clarify. Let's see if we can figure out what it is that you are thinking about, planning, writing down. We did just get through some really intense energy with that new moon in Gemini, the solar eclipse. Um, so yeah, not too surprised to see that like you're refocusing, replanning. Mm. So you have the masculine. The masculine is the lunar gods. You have 21 and 42. Um, the masculine talks about bringing balance to a situation. So we both have, we all have masculine and feminine energies within us. The masculine energy is the more protective um, provider type of energy. And it's the feminine energy is more the caretaker, nurturing type of energy. Um, so I'm feeling like you're bringing some sort of balance to um, how you provide for yourself libra or how you protect yourself and i feel like it has something to do with writing something down all right we're going to use the witch's tarot for our main spread so let's see if we can figure out what challenge or obstacle you're facing um trying to get balance to the situation does this have something to do with protecting yourself libra or providing for yourself it could be saying, too, that there's too much masculine energy um, and you need to be more nurturing in a situation. It could be saying that also. So you have King of Swords. So no, it's about protecting yourself. Um, King of Swords is your thoughts, clarity. Um, I always get with this card, like, it's, it's like fighting with a force. Um you have there's a force behind you like an like a um you're having to protect yourself forcefully lesson already learned that can help you with this challenge or obstacle we have the king of pentacles um so you have two kings here king of pentacles is someone who you could possibly be putting up on a pedestal um, King of Pentacles is someone who has everything they need. They don't go without anything. They're very abundant, um, very in control. Um, I'm almost getting like a cocky kind of attitude. It is an earth sign. I don't really try, I don't try to do signs too much because it can be anyone. But I'm getting it's like someone you've put up on a pedestal. And this is most likely who you're having to protect yourself from or defend yourself from. Um, it could have something to do with like words or thoughts or it could have something to do with like worth. Um, a lot of times the King of Pentacles, when it's in your um, lessons already learned, this is like someone that you allowed to control your worth or to control how you saw your worth. Something like that, Libra. Outcome, you have the hanged one. So you could feel like the outcome of the situation is some sort of sacrifice. Like you have to sacrifice something or someone because I am seeing King of Swords and King of Pentacles. Um, Libra, it's possible that you're having to deal with two masculines and you're having to pick. But you're not picking. The Hanged One says you're deliberating like you're thinking about it. Pros and cons, which also would be like strategizing. We are going to clarify, and we're going to use the Gilded Tarot to clarify. So for the King of Swords, is this you taking action? Is this you having to defend or protect yourself? So Knight of Pentacles. So it's you having to bring a message um, or having to deliver a message. And most likely it's going to be to this King of Pentacles. So this is in your lessons I already learned, but I feel like this is something that could be happening right now. Um, Queen of Wands is normally the person that you're reading for. Um, it's someone who's very sure of themselves, very confident, and I did feel like almost cocky, and I did kind of get that feeling with the King of Pentacles. Um, I'm feeling like it's someone you've put up on a pedestal, and you did this. You allowed them to somehow um, tell you what you were worth or control your worth in some way, something like that. 
for the hanged one. You have the sun. So I feel like you stopping and pausing and deliberating and strategizing and trying to bring balance to the situation is going to bring you like great joy, great happiness um, to yourself. I don't feel like this is necessarily about someone else. I do see other people involved, but this is very much about you. All right, Libra, we're going to do magical times next. And these are going to be direct messages from spirit to you about this situation. So you have manifestation. It says, your dreams have untold energy. Open the door and let them live. Desire and belief are your power. Mercy. Let compassion fill your world. Offer kindness to all living things. What you give, you also receive. Change. You are transforming. Let go of the past. Embrace the light and joy of this new day. So I am kind of feeling like someone is releasing um, this more controlling king situation um, for this more thoughtful, um, action oriented, um, like maybe even manifesting energy. All right, we're going to end it with a Moonology Oracle. And I do want to mention the masculine is also about manifesting. Um, so I'm feeling like someone is very much accepting change. But having compassion, because mercy is here, and it says you have compassion. You understand why you had to deal with a certain person or a certain situation. You have a show the world the real you. It's the full moon in Aquarius. All right, Libra, I'm going to leave it right there. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, if it feels like your tribe, please like and subscribe.